Hello everyone, welcome back to episode 2 of This Bed We Made. If you're watching this, I am currently on holiday, but the lovely past self of me has decided to record you a part 2, seeing as you all seem to really like it last time. Um, why are we outside of our body, everyone? Were we always outside of our body? Yeah, we were. Why did I think we were in first person? Oh, I'm not smart. Okay, so the last thing we did in the last episode is we worked this out. Um, I say we worked this out. We put the bits together. Snoop around to find the missing symbols. Okay. I don't have a notebook, but I do have a single piece of paper and a lip liner. So if I need to write anything down, then I, I definitely can. Right, so... Oh god, okay, that right. No, that's fine. That Mr. Morgan has on the wall of 505. Weren't yes, there some okay, peculiar doodles? Symbols also maybe. One here. here we go. Uh so murder is 6PO3. 6PO3. Okay, 6PO3. I'm going to say that out loud and just try and remember it and pull it in here. 6PO3. 6PO3. Six is down here, and that's you. Oh god, six. Six, P, so that means this is R. R, six, P, O, three, six, P, O, three. R, six, P, O, okay. No O's here? No D's? O, 6P03. So that means that 3 is. <laughs> Hang on, everyone. 6PO3. D? Because M didn't have one, so it's U R D E. Okay, so 3 is E. And it does appear a lot in this note, so. Okay, right. 6PO3. Good. Good. Okay. Yarn map Mr. That's Morgan stop. has on yeah, the Yeah, okay, of fine. Weren't there some peculiar doodles? Symbols, maybe. God, she just I you know every software games where they just won't stop giving you hints and you're like, I know. I got it the first time. It's kind of annoying. I wish there was the option to like turn off hints. Uh where was he? Five oh five, he's in here. Here we go. Okay. And I'm going to be a good maid and keep the doors closed behind me because I feel like someone is 100% going to stumble up on me and uh, mess me up. Okay. Okay, so not not that. What's this? Okay, so... Oh, fuck. Okay, A is two. two so, two G. L is... Okay. Okay, A is two, V is G, L is music. Two G music, A V L. Two G music, A V L. Two G music, A V L. One hundred percent gonna forget this. Oh, I do have much in my phone on me. I should probably write this down. A V L. Two G music. Is that what I said? I feel like it's probably not what I said. Okay, let's close this. Close this. There we go. AVL 2G music. AVL 2G music. AVL 2. Oh god, it's really hard to keep track of where the thing is. 2. Oh. 2. V. A V L two G music. Is there no music notes here? Yes, there is, and I put on the wrong thing. So this is L. Okay, something leave. That yarn map, Mr. Oh my God, Sophie! Sophie! There are some peculiar doodles. Sophie! Symbols, maybe. Stop! Just stop! I know we're playing a messy Sophie. Oh shit, I forgot to close the door. But come on now. Just like, just sh don't say out loud the entire time, please. Okay. Besides, you didn't even note it down when I did that. Then that. 
Pi is squiggle and four. Pi is squiggle and four, is it? Pi is squiggle and four. Is there anything else on here? This? Uh, squiggle on four. Okay. Oh, were these letters? Did they have symbols on them? No. Uh, oh no, I'm being stupid. Squiggle on four. Squiggle on four. Okay, let's go try that out. That's fine. God, I wish there was a way I could make her sprint. But no, we've got to be classy. We've got to walk, just classily. We're not protecting our womb this time. In part one, we protected our womb when we walked. No womb protection this time. She might be on the pill, but I don't know. Okay, squiggle and... Oh shit, I've already forgotten what it was. Okay, so this... That's H. Oh, fuck. H. What was I? Squiggle and fuck. No, I've completely forgotten that. That yarn map. Oh my god. Has on the wall of five hundred five. Dude, stop. Aren't there some peculiar doodles? Stop. Symbols maybe. That okay. yarn map. Oh my. Okay, so every time you come out of that. Weren't there some? Peculiar doodles? Symbols, maybe. Stop. Okay. SOS is dash dash five and eight is W. Dash dash five. Dash dash five. Dash dash five. So dash is S. I, sorry, it's so hard for me to keep track of where the fucking thing is. Dash, dash, so this is S. S, and then five is zero, is O. Okay. Is four I? I feel like it is. I will leave notes in the, yeah, okay, come on, we can work this out. So let's make this T. This is I, I think, because otherwise you wouldn't have them on their own. I. This is N, I think. Yes, in the vent. And then W is X. Next to your room. There we go. We did that together. You're not here with me physically, but you're here with me I mentally, will leave everyone. Notes in the vent next to your room. Okay. <gasps> Time to call our girlfriend. Because we are the secret homosexuals in the shadows. Clarington Hotel reception desk, Beth speaking. Hey Beth, it's me. Hey. So, how did this new thing go? Why do we have to tell Beth think? everything though, I you did. know? I found a message written in strange symbols. Oh, we a kind of secret code. A secret code? Well, spill the beans. Spill what them beans. Say? I will leave notes in the vent next to your room. In the vent? Who the hell does that? People being I don't secret. Know, but whoever the message was intended for went through a lot of trouble to hide it. It was torn in a dozen pieces and scattered in three different trash cans. Mm. So the cruises are mm. keeping secrets from each other. Do you Slay. think one of them's having an affair? I think it's blackmail? Yeah, I think it's blackmail. I don't know. It really looks like blackmail. Blackmail? What makes you say that? That's a great question. Oh, yeah? I found a bank statement belonging to Mrs. Maybe? Cruz. Her account was emptied very recently. Interesting, but it could mean a lot of things. What do you mean? 
Well, people need their money. Mm -hmm. Especially when She's they're not traveling. Wrong. She's Although not wrong. I have to admit, withdrawing all of it does seem a bit strange. Mm -hmm. Is that all you've got to back your theory? Pretty much. Yeah. But I should be able to find more proof in the vent. Let's go look. The one that I think yeah. I'll go. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm about to go on break, so if. All right. Yep. Okay. Enjoy Whatever. Cool. Oh, I will. Come on. Come on. Impatient now. Impatient Zoe's kicking in. Yes. Thank you. Context clues. Okay. Let's go. Are we gonna pick that up off the floor? Off the table? Nope. We're just gonna leave that there. This is psychological warfare we're doing here, everyone. Right. The vent next to your room. Ooh. I've been waiting for this. That was probably not a good time. To oh, come on, that. disturb him. The vent is this the vent? Surely. <gasps> Secrets. But we need um can't open these without a screwdriver. Okay, we need to find a screwdriver. Janitor's closet's nearby. Oh yeah, it's here. Let's go in here. Okay. Oh, W and J. Wendy and Jacques. I hope Wendy's doing Eugene's okay. a pro at fixing the fuse box whenever there's a power right. outage. Where's a screwdriver? Ooh. What's this? Yes, I would absolutely love to do some more snooping. Thank you. Eugene. Who's Eugene again? Eugene... The cook? Isn't the isn't Eugene the cook? Or is Eugene the Eugene's the um blah, 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 blah. they're that person, you know? The janitor? She might have literally just said it and I've already forgot. Okay. This goes here. Whoop. Whoop. There. This goes here. This goes here. Why would you rip this up? It's not to be scandalous. Let's say. Highest priority, huh? That means Eugene's probably working in Bernard's office right now. Bernard tells me there's a cold draft coming from his window and it's turning off into a freezer. Why would you rip it up, though? It sounds like Eugene asked Bernard to stop opposing the construction of the new psychiatric hospital. And Bernard was Bernard. I was unaware of your daughter's condition. I can only imagine how difficult this must be for you and your wife, but don't worry, you only have to look to my brother to see how rotten apples grow in the- What is up with this guy? What? Oh god, he's gross. William Weston is against the new hospital. Oh, Eugene. I had no idea. A friend of mine has heard from a hairdresser who's heard from a sister on law works secretary mayor. City plans to build a new mental hospital. Imagine, Denise could get the care she needs while staying close to home. It's almost too good to be true. Oh, bless. We've got tissues as well. Is this him and his... Huh. Yeah. This must be Eugene with his daughter. Aww. He looks like a caring father. Is his wife a nurse? She looks like she's in a nurse outfit. Okay, what are these? Wait. Sophie. Hey. <gasps> be careful. It's a slippery slope towards becoming well, a Well, don't hoarder. give me the option to pick them up, then. Right, we need... Shoot, no screwdriver. Hmm. What's life without a little challenge? What if I just, like, um... What if I just smashed it open? Okay, so do we need to go down to his office? Eugene's a pro at fixing the fuse box do. whenever there's a power outage. Okay, let's go down to Bernard's office. While he's busy boinking the horrible Linda... We'll grab ourselves a screwdriver, and God, I wish I could make her sprint. Sophie, I really, really, really do. Okay, let's go down there. Maybe I shouldn't wander around with my pockets. Uh, Sophie! Is there anything I can put down? Why can't you wander around with your pockets full? Another day? You're allowed to do that. Another dish to pick up. And then I have those gloves and keys. Okay. It's not like she had it slung over her shoulder, but fine. I mean, this is what it's like being a maid. It's just so much busy work. Here we go. Oh, why are we... Why is there a cutscene? Why is there a cutscene? Ugh. 
Is that Bernard, or is that... <clears throat> yes, it is Bernard. Thank you, subtitles. It's, uh, Miss Bellevent, isn't it? Yeah, what, what were you doing up here? Oh, um, right. Oh, right. Is Linda now going to appear, and it'd be super awkward? Nope. Okay. He has... You're the one who took last week off, aren't you? You had to, uh, take care of your sister, I think? Mother. My mother. She's, um... She's very sick. Where is this going, mm. Bernard? No, I hope this doesn't become a recurring thing. I need to know I can count on you. Uh, I understand, sir. I'm what sorry. What are you doing here, anyway? Are you on break? Uh, no. I need a screwdriver. No. I'm just getting a screwdriver. A screwdriver? What for? Why would you I'm care? Loose vent. Well, that sounds like a job for Eugene, doesn't it? Yes. You're right. And leave the repairs to him. Okay, I will. <clears throat> the best thing you can do if someone challenges you like that is just be like, yeah, okay, no, you're right, and then just do it anyway. If you're planning to give Bernard a good scare, sign me up. And her weird no, I'm looking skin. for a screwdriver for the vent. Linda asked Eugene to fix Bernard's window. Oh, I see. Eugene? What the hell? Uh, did he? What? You better go and take a look. Did he leave I'll it open? I'll stand guard by the elevator and make some noise if I see Bernard coming. Did you just escape? I'll be quick. Okay. Gosh, she does have very dewy skin, doesn't she? Almost jealous. I know I am jealous. I can admit I'm jealous. It's fine. I'm secure in that. I'm secure in my jealousy. Right. Is there anything else I can grab in here while I'm snooping around? Drinking at work? Not good. This does not look like a nice brotherly check-in. I had no idea things were this bad between Bernard and Raymond. Oh, I'm glad Father never got to see how you so shame so shamelessly destroyed his great legacy. You ask I lower our prices, but I tell you I plan on doing just the opposite. My guess will only be the creme de la creme. Don't be an idiot. Don't just rise, raise prices for the sake of raising prices, you jackass. Change I wish hands. I worked here when Raymond was in charge. Sounds like the hotel was very different back then. Unsavory characters hanging around. Huh. Okay. Well, this must be the three just of look them. at these distinguished gentlemen. And a young Bernard. Yeah, whatever. Okay, what else have we got? Can I open these? What? <gasps> <coughs> Sorry? Ew. Is this Linda? Oh, God. Why? What? She must have left in a fucking hurry. Jesus Christ. Oh, man. I'm so glad. I should take that and. I know. Uh, there's no point in framing Linda because this is where I want her bra to be. Absolute hypocrite. Ooh, what's this? Check in on room 602, ask Eugene to fix radio, to call Weston's office, apologise to Mr. and Mrs. Drake for Valentine's full mishap, speak with, okay, here we go, speak with contractor about cost overruns, call Weston's office again, decide winner for employee of the month reward. Okay. Is there anything else that I can know? What is this? Oh, do I have to clean this? I can't just pick up the note. Okay. Posing something that could help so many people just because it's close to your hotel? This is ridiculous. What does this say? I'd like to thank you again for agreeing to this partnership between the Clarendon Hotel and Weston's Department Store. Thanks to your generous help, renovations are well on the way, and the hotel doesn't have looked better. Another note, come to my attention, you found a group of to propose a construction of a mental hospital. Frogging so hard. You cannot allow a band of. What? To move into your backyard? Sorry for the pop there. Oh, God. Enjoy the cold, you cold-hearted prick. What? D I'm uh -huh. just going to take this. Let's get you to that vent. Oh, yeah. Oh, do I clean it up? Oh, because then Eugene's going to get fired. And if he needs to look up after his daughter. I feel like I should. I feel like I should clean this up. I should cover for him. 
Ugh, do I? This is what we did last time. Yeah, let's throw this away. And let's close this. With this blizzard, Bernard's yeah. office will be a skating rink by the end of the day. Best to avoid that. I just don't want people to get fired, you know? Like, they don't need that. Surely your break is over by now. No, it's not. Oh, I shit. came by here not too long ago, and Andrew was already covering for you. That's because I was in the ladies' room. That's no excuse to- It's my time of the month. <gasps> I, uh, nice. Yes. You're married, aren't you? So you know how it is. Weaponize that awkwardness that this and, idiot feels. Oh, sometimes I stain the furniture and, and don't get me started on all the- That's- <gasps> Oh my god, I love Beth. I, Miss Bellavet. Weaponized what femininity. What in my office? I wasn't. Someone left the drawer. Drawer, drawer. Drawer to jar. I wasn't. I was. I was simply closing the door. Someone left it ajar. Huh. Must have been Eugene. Well, try to lie a bit better well, than that, you don't fool. Don't you have work to do? Yes, sir. Then get to it. God, you're a wanker. Mr. Drake has asked to see you again. God, he just can't get enough of me, can he? Oh, just like indulge this. him. Apologize one more time for Friday's okay, mishap. Yeah. Oh, I can't skip this. I'm a very impatient we person. cannot afford to lose such loyal guests. Okay, fine. What happened at the Valentine's Ball? Did someone get an olive stone somewhere? Yeah, come on. Nothing unusual. That was a close one. Yeah, I had a few cold sweats. But at least I found what I was looking for. Hooray. Good. Well, if you need me... I'll be attending to the whims and worries of our entitled client guests. Guests. Don't be a stranger. Oh, Beth. The wink. We're absolutely going to try and flirt with her and make her our girlfriend. Don't worry, everyone. I wouldn't dream of not doing that. Okay. Let's go get this vent open. Here we go. Ding. Yeah, that's it. Sassily folding the arms. No wound protecting here. Ding! Okay, cool. Made me think something was going to happen whenever there's a cutscene I get jumpy. Right. She's walking a bit faster now, at least, it looks like. Excited to find out what that note is. Oh, I guess I'm free to disturb room 508 now. That's where Bernard and Linda were. Oh, yeah. Ew. We're going to get evidence and we're going to humiliate them. Ooh, rotate LS. Oh, did that work? Oh, I have to hold it down. Okay. Thanks for coming on this journey, everyone. That's it. A bit more. Perfect. And that one. Hold RT to move. Whoop! Let's just grab this. So did she just have a screwdriver on her all the time? Okay, what does it say? Well, I can't believe we're still doing it in their room. This feels like a mistake. Right, so S. I hate this way of selecting letters. What was the, like, that's L. Okay, everyone. Meet me tonight in my room. Michael will be sleeping. We need to discuss our plan. What plan is that, huh? So we're about to find out. Meet me tonight in my room. Michael will be sleeping. We need to discuss our plan. Why would you not just be like, meet me in my room? Don't put on extra information you don't need. So someone finds it, it's going to be really suspicious. Clarington Hotel reception desk, Beth speaking. It's me. Oh, hello, Bean. Anything Bean! Oh my god, do we have a nickname? I found another message written. What yeah. okay. Meet me tonight. This is just repeating a lot of information already knew. Another husband? I don't know. It's the first time I'm hearing of a Michael in this story. Agree. Hmm. Let me check the log book. Thanks, Beth. There's a Michael staying in room 507. Miss Beaumont's room? Oh. But she doesn't have a husband. She's here alone with... Oh, Michael must be her son. Right. I got him some extra blankets the other day so he could build a fort. Oh, cute. Could Marcella... 
Yes. Uh, no, never mind. <laughs> Could she be so, one of them gays? I guess I should go have a look at 507. Yeah, okay. But okay. it's not on my list. There's a do not disturb sign on the door. Well, I could call the room to make sure no one's there. Good idea. Hang on. Thanks, Beth. Oh, I think we might be good. Might we be good? You've got the all clear, Bean. Bean! Head on over. Thanks, Beth. I'll call you back. Okay, I'm totally gonna date her after this. Once again, just gonna leave those incriminating notes on the coffee table. That's probably fine. Can I not, like, at least throw them away or something? Yeah, okay, thank God for that. Let's just let's not be an idiot here. God, it would have been really stupid if I had left them there, huh? Really stupid. God, I'm glad I realised I could throw them away. Okay, first we're gonna go in here. Did she just leave her thing here? Just gonna clean this. Ugh. This. Oh. Uh, sorry. I'm just getting my left and my right mixed up again. What? There we go. Oh, trying to think about what happened in this bed. Oh, they just they just had some champagne, did they? Huh. Good to know they're having such fun. Oh. Oh. Not even put them in the bin? Come on. Really? Not even in the bin? Okay, I don't know why there would be anything in here. Because. Yeah, they're not staying here. There's not going to be anything in those things. Anything in the trash? No. Anything in the bathroom? Oh. Rose petals! My god. Pulled out all the stops. What's this? Uh. Wow, that's hypocritical to leave in here. Anything else? No, they didn't have a shower afterwards. It doesn't need to be cleaned. Okay. I'm just doing my job, everyone. God. Can I not just do my job? Leave that there. I think that's everything, isn't it? Can I pull the curtains? Nope. Yeah, okay. I think that's everything. Let's just check in the cupboard real quick. Nope, nothing in here. Okay. But I now do have her nightgown. So I can use that to feel like I'm in her skin, which will be fun. Sounds like a fun thing, right? I'm sure I'll find more laundry to add to the pile. Okay, where am I going? Five or seven in here. Why would you say do not disturb if no one's in there? You just don't want anyone to go in, I guess. Brandy. Oh, cherry brandy as well. Christmassy brandy. Okay, once again, let's close this door. Okay, where should we start? Let's just have a look in here first. And I'm not going to clean anything this time because I'm, I'm. We weren't supposed to be in here. Looks like someone grew tired of looking at your face, Mr. Beaumont. And I think that might be a wedding ring. Yep. Well, she's having a good time and I love her for it. I'm not going to clean that. Oh, there's a little bow. Oh, That's very cute. What good mum. Right. And then this is, I don't know what that is, what's this? He's all but outright threatening you. Oh, I hope you can stay as far away from him as possible. Do you think I don't know where you spend your nights? Okay, well, he's obviously a dick. Is this lipstick? Ooh. Ooh. Okay, no, I am not going to, oh, what? What's this? Oh, is she like sitting and smoking there in the bathroom? Huh. She seems like an okay mom. Oh, an okay mom. Look. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, what did she write down? Oh, Michael. Oh. Adults can be so 
confusing. I promise it's not you. Hmm. Poor Michael. Little pencil. Little car. Hair rollers. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, wait, what's so this? So you were eager to set up a meeting, but didn't want anyone noticing. Hmm. Been on the train for two days now, maybe even longer by the fact I cannot wait to see you again. We're scheduled to arrive in Montreal on the eve of Valentine's Day. I booked, for, I booked room 509. It's a marital suite. Oh, Gay lovers, I love it. Oh, so cute. Let them be happy, goddammit. Funny how some games really mm. stand the test of time. I used to play this with mom all the time. Dear Miss Bercy, we successfully processed your request to withdraw your son from his school schedule. Huh. Good. She's, uh, proactive. That's good. Teaching grammar. Excellent. Good. Sounds like this is from your school days, but the name of the sender is smudged. I miss the snow already. I'll leave for Montreal on the 8th. I miss our late night studying session at Harry's. I even miss Sister Millie's classes, if you can believe it. Oh. What's this? Aha. Keys are Snoop's best friend. Fancy key. Jesus. Okay, yeah, we're going to take that. And we're going to unlock something. It's a little drawer out of it. What's this? God, I love Snoop so, so much. So husband can abuse his wife and just get away with it? And people like Linda still think divorce is wrong? Ugh. So messed up. Empty photo frame. A collar. Greta for the cat in the letter. Oh. Yeah, let's. Oh. Wait a second. Where's the other key? The other key. Does Marceline have the other key? Or Marcella? Oh. Yeah, they must be in this picture, surely. Oh, wait, open. <gasps> Mount Royal College, Montreal. Okay. Where's the other key, though? Where is it? Mr. Cruz, huh? Hmm. Lipsticks! Lipsticks! Two different colours of lipsticks! Definitely came here. A hundred percent. Some smokes. Okay. Will the other key be in here? No. Right. Where's the second key? Should we try looking in these drawers? Hmm. Nope, nothing in here. Right, what's, what's this? What's this? Something I can't interact with. Okay, would Michael have it? In here? Oh, it makes no sounds though. Nothing in here. No. No. Okay, it's not in here. Hell is it? Where's this other key? That? Nope. Not here. Not in the envelope. Funny how some games really mm. stand the test of time. I used to play this with my Oh, here we go. Oh, those few coins in my tip jar were getting pretty lonely. They'll appreciate the company. Oh, uh, I actually didn't want to do that. Actually, can I put that money back or is I'll know someone's been here? That look in your eyes. What does it mean? And who is this from? Is that from Beth? It did sound like Beth knew that she might be bi. Maybe Beth's bi as well? Well, it's kind of how would you know? Or gay? Ah, oh, that's so sweet. Aww. I didn't do much, but I'm glad it meant something to you. Thank you so much for taking care of our- Aww. Oh, so that was for you. Okay, right, cool. But they haven't left yet. I guess... Ooh, what's this? Something at the back. Can I not get that? 
No? Okay, fine. Anything else? What's this? Screwed up. Oh, bullshit. Piss off. Uh, yeah, okay, so this is them two. Where the hell is this other- is it in here? No. I mean, I assume Marcella has the other key. Surely. Let's have a look at her things. If I can find a key, I can take a look for myself. Okay. Right, this is just all the things I have. I think I need the other key and I feel like it would be in... Uh, I'll need another key to unlock this. Haven't I seen one just like this somewhere? Yeah, it must it must be Marcella's room, surely. Okay, well clearly no one is doing anything on this floor, so I'm gonna leave that door open just this once. And I swear to god if it comes back to bite me in the ass, I'm gonna get very annoyed at the inconsistent nature. Okay, right. It must be on her desk, right? Right. Yeah, in here. Anything else? No, that's the only thing I can pick up here. Close that. Birth control, love that. Good. Wait, hang on a second. Sorry, I didn't actually. This looks read that. right up Andrew's alley. I wonder if he's read this one. Hmm. I mean, she doesn't want have kids with him, which is fair. This Lysol again. Where the... is it in here? Locked. It looks like the code is made up of four letters. Locked. It looks like the sure, code it's, is it's made up of four letters. Must be Anne, right? That's the name of the Beaumont lady. Because they're in love. Where the hell is this key? Uh, is it in here? Somewhere? No, okay. Where the frick is it? I'm not being dumb. Yeah, no, not there. Not in the bin. I thought it would be in her suitcase, but I can't see it. Is it over here? Does he have the other key? The guy? Okay, not that. This? Nope, that's just a rosary. Where the hell is this key? Is it in no because if it's these two meeting what the fuck is it i'm being stupid oh viewers am i being stupid is it near here somewhere what's this Ooh, fancy the shade is really mm. striking Oh, hang on a second. Let's just... Let's close this. There we go. Okay. Right. Let's try these drawers. No. No. No? Okay, so I looked at where you got to find it, and I would not have looked here unless I'd looked at a uh, walkthrough. So you need to come here, open the safe, and then if you look here... She's wearing it on her neck. Here we go. Ah, oh, there you are. There we go. With Marcella. And God knows where she is. Okay, let's exit this. I would not have known to look there Clarington at all. Hotel reception desk. Beth speaking. Hey, Beth. Oh, Bean. already wrong. Okay. I've been meaning to speak with you. Bean. Oh, about what? Well, a little birdie told me Mr. Morgan and Mr. Cruz had an argument uh -oh. yesterday evening. Really? Who's your little birdie? Jacques. Hmm. Apparently it got so heated he had to get involved. Uh-oh. And listen to this. It sounds like I was on the right track. 
Because he heard a particular word cool. thrown around quite a lot. Gay. Wanna Cheating. A fair. A fair? Cowboy. Go. Hmm. Did Jack hear hmm. anything else? From what he told me, it seemed like Mr. Cruz was accusing Mr. Morgan of having an affair with his wife. Hmm. Wouldn't have expected Mrs. Cruz to fall for a man like Morgan, but I guess the heart wants what the heart wants. Maybe, but that doesn't yeah, explain what? Mrs. Beaumont's involvement with Mrs. Cruz. What do you mean? I found a chest in room 507. I found okay, one yeah. of them. Oh? Well, I the other ones on her neck. Mrs. Cruz wears it. Wait, yeah. so Mrs. Yeah, yeah there's definitely. Yeah, obviously. Uh, I think they're having an affair. I think Mrs. Cruz and Mrs. Beaumont might be the ones having the affair. That's an interesting theory. Thank you. Did you find any clues that might support this? The lipstick. Nothing concrete. The lipstick! I mean, I did find a letter that suggests they may have gone to college together, but <laughs> yeah. I guess we'd know for sure if we could have a look. I've looked around yep. room 509. I've seen the second I key there. I would have seen the second key if it was there. Hmm. We were so... Well, hold on. I may have an idea. What Get idea? me a candle and some plaster, and maybe I can do something about that pesky chest. How? I'll tell you later. Just find... All right. Come on. You're going to make a wax you know. key? Is that even going to stand up to being turned? Okay, close this. Uh, and what do we need to do now? Crap, I've already forgotten. Bring her a candle and some plaster. Right? Okay, where would I find a candle and some plaster? Let's go look in the janitor's closet. Probably something a janitor would have. Candle and some plaster. Nothing that looks like a candle here. Okay, let's look. What have I written in my notebook? Mm. Okay. Right. Yeah, it's renovation, so there should be a bag of plaster somewhere. If I was a ba- Oh, there we go. Great. Perfect. This takes care of half of this little scavenger hunt. Doesn't As for the candles, doesn't Rebecca keep some in her locker downstairs? Doesn't she? Doesn't she? Which one's Rebecca again? Is she the dick? Cannot remember. No, Yvette's the dick, right? Surely? Because she's the one who cut Wendy out of things. Rebecca, where are you? Etienne, Gabriel, Eugene, something that's not Rebecca, Jacques, Anthony. Where's Rebecca? Fixing the window should be a top priority. And oh, I'd very much like to speak to him, trust me, but I just can't find him. He's nowhere to be found. Gone. Disappeared. Uh, I don't know what. Maybe he shouldn't have been a dick. I guess he quit, didn't he? I oh, mean, I should have left the note there. Carol. I've already forgotten. Rebecca? Did I just walk past Rebecca? Beth. Here we go, Rebecca. Right. Uh. Where the... So you do have a stash of candles. But where is it? Where's your stash? Uh, blah, blah, blah. $4 roast beef. 602's getting on the nerves. Where is it? Okay, hang on. Let me just read this again properly. Kins out of pouch again. Burn wants to continue. Start hoarding candles. Where's your stash? It's urgent, please. Okay, and then maybe she wrote a reply and it's in Bobby's wallet? Bobby's thing? That was out here, wasn't it? The thing that I couldn't read. Mm, I'm good. Okay. I'll just try and see if Wendy was still there. Anthony, Jacques, Bobby. Okay. No candles, but this looks like the laundry room. Okay, so that's where it is. Ooh. Oh, close the door. There we go. Let's go look in the laundry room for these candles. And oh, right. Oh, for God's sake. Is this the break room? Yes, right. God, it's a lot of walking around in this, isn't it? You get your steps in so quickly. Okay, where's... I can't believe that I fell in love with you. 
Wait. What? I, I want my mother's ring back. What? There. I don't want it here. What? What the hell happened? Have I missed something? Jesus. Okay, right, where are my keys? Are they, I was here, wasn't I? Don't worry, Gossiper. I'm coming back to you. Oh, there is. Okay. I still haven't this. learned all I've got to hold on to these tight. Pick that up. Perfect. What does this say? I want my Tupperwares back. Okay, Susan. What does this say? I just love reading notes. What can I say? Mm. Just bullshit. Okay. Right, let's go into the laundry room. Sorry, Jacques. But I am gonna... S Sorry, what was that? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. They've done all of them up. Oh, that's amazing. Excellent. Barbara and Mary have never looked so good. Yeah, I'm just going to assume that Wendy was in the right. I just like to default to that when it comes to stuff like this. Right. Uh, so... This is where the stuff is. The candles are in this cabinet over here. Uh, or they're in this cabinet. Or they're in this cabinet. There we go. Stash uncovered. Fab got a candle. Right. Now, what next? We need to wait for Beth to come back from her break. That is what's next. Off we trot. Trot, 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 trot. Not protecting our womb again, but that's fine. And then let's try and find... There we go, perfect. There you are. Hello. I'm not sure I understand what the plan is here. Well, when I was little, we had padlocks on many of the farm's sheds. Mm -hmm. My dad would always lose the keys, so one day he made a mold of them using wax and plaster. Smart. I was thinking of doing the same. Are you sure it's gonna work? Absolutely not. Yeah, it was the hey, wax too I guess weak. we won't know until we try. Yeah, you're right. So let's do this. Science is happening. Do you cook plaster? Okay. To start, we need to pour the wax from the pot. Oh, I've been really stupid. They're going to make the, the key out of the plaster, not the wax. Ooh. There we go. Have you done this before? You're a real pro. Yeah, I'm really good at pouring. Now, let's give it a few seconds so the mold really takes form. Good. That okay, there. I think you can remove it. Take this well, out. Well, we're almost there. Just pour the cup of plaster Ooh. into the mold. There we go. All right. Ta-da! Now we wait for it to dry. Oh my god, what should we do while we wait? How long do you think wait? it's going to take? I don't know. I guess should we'll we... keep poking it every now and then. What if we kiss while we wait, huh? I bet you didn't think you'd be making a plaster key today, huh? <laughs> Indeed. But I like it. It's she rare that short this nails, job that's allows all me I'm to saying. use my creative side. Your creative side? Well, granted, this key won't end up in any museum, but <laughs> I enjoy the occasional artistic endeavor. Like drawing? Like drawing? Oh, God, no. I once drew a dress that everyone mistook for a birthday hat. <laughs> I never drew again after that. What about you? Haven't I seen you drawing in that journal of yours? You? Yeah, I doodle a little. Hey, you should show me one day. Oh. I'd love to see your art. Supportive, Beth. Okay, but promise not to laugh. Nope. What? I'd, I'd never, ever do that. Oh, I know Beth. I make fun of pretty much everything, but not people's art. That's their soul. I'm sure we it's beautiful. It. Thanks. What do you like to draw, anyway? It's kind of silly, but I've started working on this little Women. comic in which I imagine my life as a celebrity. A celebrity? Yeah. I've always found the lives of famous people so fascinating, you know? And... I kind of envy them sometimes. All the drama, the excitement. Yeah, because we're really lacking in <laughs> drama and excitement today. <laughs> well, today's the exception. I'm sure there's something else in your life that excites you. Well, I do like sailing. Excuse me? You sail? On a boat? On a boat. <laughs> I used to, 
with my grandpa. But when he died, we had to sell the boat to pay off his debts. Oh, that's too bad. I would have loved to go with you. Maybe we can still find a way. Maybe it'd be possible to borrow a boat for a day. I think one of Grandpa's friends still has his. Really? That would be great. Date. I just love trying new things. I'll see what I can do. Date, 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 date. Hey, look. I think it's dry. I can't believe it worked. I could not have done this without it's you. Must be very yeah, strong pasta. Probably not. <laughs> Well, I should get back upstairs before Bernard notices. Maybe she give me a kiss before you go. We're, go we're going on a date. No, we're no, almost go girlfriends. Oh, and uh, be careful while turning it, okay? Yes. You wouldn't want it to break inside the lock. There yeah. we go. I'll be careful. Thank you for everything. No problem. Excellent. And let's just leave this here for someone else to clean up. I think that's okay. Oh no! Wait, we have to clean it up because it's our. Oh fuck. Jesus, we are very efficient at cleaning up. My God. Okay, everyone. Well, I think I'm going to leave it there for today. Uh, do leave a comment below if you want to see another part of this. I feel like we're getting... I don't know how long this game is, but I think we're about halfway through probably. So if you want to see what's in the chest, let me know and we can find out together. And I hope all of you have a lovely week. Goodbye.